I've seen renewal, and I've seen it in the area of teaching the right values. So I understand that the world can change and worldview can change if you are clear about what you care about and you teach it to children. So when we have the opportunity to be with, uh, like I did this morning, with a bunch of kids who were enthusiastic, asking me questions, listening, uh, having fun, we need to pass on all the information that we know now, which I didn't know when I was their age, because they will be the ones making much, much better decisions than we have made. There are young Samoans and young Polynesian people working towards a brighter future and leaving something for the next generation after us. Greetings in Talofa. My name is Patricia Pintito. I am 15 years of age. I am now attending Manua High School and I hail from the beautiful village of Palasau Manua. My school and also my community, we always talk about ocean, how to protect and how important the ocean is. We've learned that we should protect our coral reef because that is where fishes are. We should not fitter and step on corals. We should take good care of them because it is where we get food and it is also a fun place to swim and snorkel. If you're a kid now, early in the 20th century, You've got to be the luckiest kids ever born. Think about it. You know things that your parents could not know when they were kids, let alone your grandparents, your great-grandparents, or anybody who ever lived before. You are the beneficiary of all that knowing, all that understanding. The astronauts up in the sky brought back the news. I've been down in the ocean. Lots of people have been gathering information, giving it to you. Now is the time. You are armed with more knowing than any kid who's ever been around. You carry in your pocket, a lot of you do, information about the universe that the smartest people who've ever lived before could not know what you know. Never again will there be a better time for you to do what it takes to explore this beautiful blue planet and to take care of it. Time's running out in a way, but this is the best time. If you could be born anywhere in time, be born now. This is the time. I am looking for seeing the Hukulia. When Rex and Veronica came at our school, they were talking about the Hokulia. So they had this competition writing the essay. So I wanted to join in. So while I was writing my essay, my mother helped me. I wrote it in Samoan. I feel happy about knowing a lot of things about the Hokulea. People used to navigate around the world using the star compass. So I just want to let the whole world know that we should all know more information about Okulia. The National Marine Century has helped me expand my mindset and work towards a better future for American Samoa and the next generation on providing more marine protected areas and educating a generation of American Samoa to provide a different lifestyle. The Hokulea coming to American Samoa is one of the greatest events that have ever happened in my lifetime. Basically, this island is connecting back to the Tupunga, or the ancestors, and how our forefathers used to navigate the Pacific. I will be sailing on the Hokulea. I'm quite excited to be on this voyage and carry up the message and connecting different cultures, provide a more sustainable world. I would like to thank our Heavenly Father for being with us. And also I would like to give thanks to the National Marine Sanctuary of American Samoa
for giving me this opportunity and also I'd like to thank everyone for watching what I feel and how I am to be a Manu. Thank you.